Here we are, ladies and gentlemen, with another modern... I don't want to say homebrew versus homebrew. You'll know what I'm playing, you'll know what she's playing, but different takes on established decks. On established, not exactly tier one decks. So I will pick among these. Okay, okay. That's mine, you pick yours. Any meeny miny moe catch a tiger by the toe. If you caught a sun gun, my mother told me to pick the very best one and you are it. It's the tiger! Yes! Catch a tiger by its toe. Very nice. And then there's the lizard. And then here's the poison counter. Because you know, T1 Glistener Elf. Before we get started, uh, food or drink first? Drink. Okay. This is already showing. Cinnamon tea. This is already showing as well now. Hot, 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 hot. Little bit. Try not to get it on that GP map, or yeah, the GP map, please. Okay. You're good. You haven't gotten it on there yet. Ooh. It's very I like tasty. It. It's I like it a lot. Mm -hmm. And now for food. <laughs> Just gonna be om nomming away. Uh, why? Well, because I've been having finals and haven't made a video for you in a while. Uh, but because I've been having finals, she wanted to give me a good reprieve, so chocolate-covered strawberries. We don't have these, like, ever. I can't remember. I may have had one when I was, like, 12 okay. at some yeah. point. Yeah. I'm not, I'm not. I can't. <laughs> I'm bad at this, apparently. All right. Shall we begin? Mm-hmm. We've already shuffled and cut it, haven't we? I'm pretty sure. Work. Well, fine then. <laughs> and actually, we should get you something to. Do you chew like a cow? Come on now. Oh. I'm good at this. <laughs> See? I'm good at this, ladies and gentlemen. I do this for a living. Anyway, after we cut all of that out, time for us to begin. Mwahahaha. Five, six, seven. All right. Ooh. Well, this is an interesting and probably not keepable hand. Hmm. There are so many things that can go wrong with this, actually. Oh, dear. Either I really suck at shuffling three different times, or um, you suck at cutting. And I would venture to bet that it's me sucking at shuffling. And here is why, ladies and gents. One. Alright. This would be why. I'm going to keep the hand anyway. <laughs> I'm going to six. Feel free to cut. Okay. There you go. Mm-hmm. My lovey hubby. Whoops. Yeah, despite the lack of ring, we are married. Huh. Unfortunate accident. <laughs> I will keep this hand. Well, it has one distinct improvement in it, or rather, it, it, there's something that's lacking that was in the last hand that I want to be lacking. I don't think she knows what I'm on. I honestly don't. I know what she's on. I don't I'll think she knows. Me. Yes? I, I mean, yeah, there are a lot of different Eldrazi. Yeah, I am. That doesn't really narrow it down much, but... Um... <laughs> Flying Spaghetti Monster. You had it in your hand. You do not want that in your hand starting off, especially. Okay. Close, close enough. Let's do this. Oh, yeah. I go wait, first. Wait, 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 wait. There we are. <laughs> Man, I powered through that strawberry. I'm mm -hmm. sorry. <laughs> I didn't even wait for you. Bad about that. <laughs> go for it. Well, one day, 
Oh. Hmm. Your turn. Okay. I really don't know what he's playing. All I know is that he likes to put um, flying spaghetti monsters in his face. So already you're seeing an innovation to this deck. Uh, some burn lists, you may know, are running uh, Gurmog Angler in that slot. Uh, some are running Tassiger, if they have green or blue in there. Uh, this one is actually trying out Gouldraw's Assassin. And also, we used to have him Pyromancer. Uh, part of this is just trying to do something creative. Part of it is, frankly, because... Past turn. Uh, no, no, I just said past turn. Did I really just say past turn? Do you want to take backseat? Yeah, that's not something I would do in an actual competition. I'm distracted by talking to the camera. That's why I asked. Sleight of hand. There we go. There we go. Might I see sleight of hand? Top two cards. One goes in my hand. One goes to the bottom. Anyway, so uh, we used Young Pyromancer in a previous version. Um, this one uses Ghoul Draw's Assassin. Sometimes that's a budget choice. Hmm, this is tricky. I think I take you to hand. And some of it is... I'm... yes, past turn. Now let me just focus on what I'm trying <laughs> to say. Some of it's trying to be creative, some of it's a budget choice because we don't have enough goblin guys, but we will, we will, because Modern Masters 2015, Modern Masters 2, holy crap! <laughs> That's why I said you didn't. Well, okay. <laughs> I'll yeah, 19. <laughs> that's, that's an unusual hand. <laughs> I see what you mean. Okay. But okay. this is a little bit different from the last time I played the deck. Oh, yeah. So there's some definite changes to it. So I wasn't Serum exactly visions? sure what was in here. Draw a card and scry two. Mm-hmm. Jay just likes to surprise me sometimes. Hmm. This is tricky. You're definitely not here. <laughs> Good surprises as we see as Gold Draw is vampire. Past turn. And now for the ouchies. <laughs> I gave you a deck that I am positive is very favored against me here. Quite. Hmm. Swing for three. Go to sixteen. Draws oh, good God, really? I had all four in my opening hand. Uh, well, okay. That's a hand. And two land. You'd think she's on, like, Jun Vampires, just <laughs> judging by this. That's turn? Um, no. Oh, my goodness. More? Lava Spike. Okay. Put me to 13. Now it's your turn. Peek. Look at your hand, mm -hmm. draw a card. Lightning. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> and with that, ugh, I hate my odds right about now. Well, it didn't hurt that I had all four in my opening hand with two lands mm -hmm. and a lightning. Hmm. Well, at least I know what the last card in your hand is. That's not a whole lot of velocity <laughs> left. Let's see, if you blightning me here... Oh, wait a minute. It's ten or less. So you kill me next turn, actually. You can kill me next turn. That's fine. That's great. Sorry. Why are you saying sorry? This is actually kind of exciting. I'm about to die horribly. Hmm. Yeah, because Blightning's three, and that ups all these to three twos with Intimidate. 
and then you swing at me on, to kill me on turn four. Yep. Welcome to magic. <laughs> this is the first time I've done something like that. <laughs> I don't think I can win, but... Hey, go down swinging. I'm gonna damn well try. Good. Hmm. Wouldn't have it any other way. Ow. I actually kind of popped okay. something in there. No, no, it's good. Not that kind of ow. Ooh. One of those I pop my neck and it automatically feels better. Hmm. So, lines of play here. I cannot see. I cannot see. I cannot. Don't win without this. At this point, I don't think I have enough time. I'm sure I don't have enough time to go for the kill that this deck usually tries to have. So I think I have to kill off a few. Given that... Um, oh, and by the way, and you're in here too. So these make a great couple, one with the other. They really do. Unfortunate, and by the way, the reason for that. Unfortunately, I don't know that I survive the next turn. You might. You might. I have three cards in the yard. Puts you to four. Yeah, I, I don't. I don't win this game. I just can't at this point. You don't know. I could do something incredibly stupid, which is. Like, not, not attacking? Unusual. That's Even if you don't attack, I'm going to remind you. <laughs> I'm going to remind you to not forfeit the game for no reason here. <laughs> Ink Moth. That's a dude. Ooh. Pass turn. I'm sure you're going to turn him into a creature and block with him. It's like she knows me or something. <laughs> Oh, but that doesn't come in tapped. Sorry. Oh, I was a blood crypt for just a moment. <clears throat> Alright, here it is. Lightning to my face. Now, I have a number of choices here. I could... Here for an answer. I do have a four of that stops that in its tracks. Or I could try to add to my hand first, you know, and remove one of her attackers. It would put me to one next turn. Four if I block. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. I am so screwed no matter what happens here. I'm sorry. I'm going to peer through depths, look at the top five cards, add an instant or sorcery from among them, and put it into my hand. Here's my hand. It's just very distinctly not my hand. Well, we didn't exactly fizzle, we just didn't get what we needed. So I think I lose on the spot here. Yeah, I'll concede. There you go. Another. That, that was my a, next card. Nice. That Although, wasn't a bad was hand on my part. Off. It was just not that. <laughs> that was pretty pretty outstanding, actually. We had suddenly 12 damage. Well, 15 with lightning, but 12 damage in creatures. I wasn't sure if that was a good hand to keep or a bad hand, but I figured oh, four God. one drops. Did you have all four in your opener? Holy crap! With black mana? With two black sources? Holy crap you keep that! Heck yeah! And a blightning. Blightning was the other one, so I was okay. hoping to draw into the Oh, the next land. Source. All right. So what did we learn from that? That was a great hand. That's what we learned from that. All right. So, if I'm trying to prove that Ghoul Draws Vampire can actually do something, <laughs> I think I you think just I'm did doing it. a good job. <laughs> I think you get to go first. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> Let's see if I can keep these seven. Four, five, six, seven. 
imminently capable. May I? Flip. Oh. Ow. <laughs> I rolled my, um, my ankle, and so I'm having problems walking right now. Um, not the best hand. Not the god hand I had last time. But, um, overall not bad. So, hopefully, hopefully it will be good enough to keep me alive. You too. Not so much in draw power, but I can just kind of sit back forever with this. At least that's the plan. All right. Ready? Yep. Round one. Begin. Ding. Fight. If <laughs> that works. <laughs> yeah. We'll play a land, and we're actually going to pay the mana for Gitaxian Probe. Because burn. Let's not do your job for Give you. Give me just a moment. Oh, you're sorting it? Yeah. All right. So what's she have? Oh, you just saw it. <laughs> Bloodstained Mire, Blood Crypt, Black Cleave. So lands. Lava Spike, Bump, Skull Crack, Terminate. You really don't know what I'm... Well, actually, you do know a little bit. Terminate's not awful here. I think I just scooched the camera. Whoops. I'll fix that in a sec. Okay. Would you mind playing Revealed since we're on camera? Go ahead. And then I'll draw, and then pass the turn. Oh, they, they very much cannot see. See, this is why I flipped the screen for you. Sorry. You can look at the screen and see if they see it. And they very much cannot. Well, I have too many cards for it to... Okay, just... Blood Sandmire? Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and crack it. You know what, we never adjusted these back. Whoops. Yeah, whoops. That goes here. Go and search. Search, 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 search. For what are we searching? I said, for what are we searching? You'll see in just a moment. Tapped? Mm, no, it won't come in tapped. I'll pay two more. For Would you like the... to bump or spike me? I was planning on bumping you, if that's okay with you. It has to be, I'm afraid. 17 all. Pass turn? Yes. Do you mind if I have a bite of the strawberry? Om nom on it. Om nom 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 nom. Hmm. I'll use my island that was given to me by Card CC, apparently a store on TCG Player. They weren't. They don't even know that I'm saying this. They didn't. Certainly didn't know that I was about to say something like that about them. But because they were nice and just said thanks, Jay. You know, on their island they got me, and it's a pretty. It's a pretty one as well. I'm just gonna give them a shout out for being cool dudes. <laughs> anyway. How about sleight of hand? Mm -hmm. Top two cards. Pass turn. It's good. Mm -hmm. um. <laughs> it's that time. And tap. Mm -hmm. Upkeep. Nada. Draw. Oh yeah. <laughs> I'm just gonna let that whoa. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna tap for a lava spike. A spike I'm gonna spell here. pierce it. Okay. Mm. That'll be my turn.
Good grief. <laughs> and then I will pass the turn to you. Five cards in hand, two of which I know the identity. Yes. Hmm. What are you thinking? Nothing much. Says the one who's about oh. to kill me. Hmm. And does it go through or does it not? Should I stay or should I go? Should I stay or should I go now? I really don't like doing this here. Hmm. Manalik? Mm, and that's okay, one extra? Unless you pay three extra. Well, it's gone. <laughs> Anything else? Nope, not this one. Okay. Serum Visions, draw one, scry two. Mm hmm. Those are gorgeous islands, by the oh, way. Thank you. Especially like that one. Pass turn. <coughs> hmm, that's unusual. What are you saving that skull crack for? Um. Okay, Rift Bolt one. is suspended, yes. Your turn. You're being awfully conservative for a burn player. Yeah, I know. I feel bad, but... <laughs> I see that Ink Moth Nexus and it actually really bothers me. <laughs> Skullcrack doesn't hit creatures. The skull crack is the one I was talking about you being conservative yeah, with. Yeah, I know, but I want to leave mana open for Pass turn. Right? You could have fired it off then. I wasn't going to hit you. Yeah, oh, never mind. Sorry. Very unusual for a burn player. I'm sorry. Stop and saying you're sorry. Rift Bolt comes in. Yeah, I'm thinking. Oh, you already drew, but, you know, we're being casual. Sorry. Um... Take back these. Rift Bolt comes in. I will remand it. Comes back to your hand. And I draw a card. Did no, you already draw? Well, oh, no, you just I put, put it back. back. <laughs> okay. Here's what we're left with. Rift Bolt. Suspend it again? Yeah. Okay. Your turn. Pass turn. I'm gonna crack the skull crack at the end of your turn. Hmm. Spell snare? That's why I wasn't cracking it. Yeah. Never listen to your opponent when they try to give you advice. Uh, that's it. Pass turn. Rift bolt comes in. That's three. Put me to 14.
This card is looking less and less useful as time goes on, especially since I know it's in her hand. No, you don't. Not all of it. Terminate. I know Terminate's in there. Oh, hi, Bob. Bob resolves. That's a nightmare to have to deal with. Pass turn? Mm-hmm. That is an utter nightmare to have to deal with. Yeah. Bob's pain in the ass. Oh, pain in the butt. Sorry. Alright, I'm going it. to tap Ink Moth for mana and turn it to a creature. Using his own mana to turn himself into a creature. Okay. Polymorph. On the Ink Moth Nexus. What does Polymorph do? Sorry. Destroy target creature, then its controller reveals cards from their library until they hit another creature. And then that creature gets put into play. Okay. If you destroy the creature that I'm trying to uh, polymorph, then you effectively negate the spell because it does have a target. Okay. I'm just going to preempt you here and say I have a spell pierce. Dark face. Just out of curiosity, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. That would be enough. That would actually. Okay. That's actually so, a really good. Peer through depths. Repeal. Jace, Architect of Thought, Spells, the Sleight of Hand, Rune Chanter's Pike, Serum Visions, this is going to take a while if I just go at that pace, Peak, Sleight of Hand, Island, Island, Rune Chanter's Pike, Gitaxian Probe, Gitaxian Probe, Island, Polymorph, Cloud Form, Polymorph, notice no creatures yet. Yep. Repeal. I know that the last <laughs> creature is going to be the one that you need. Conclave, the next. Spell Pierce, Island, G guess what it is. Um, is it? Well, it's not the flying spaghetti monster. Um, it's not. Ulamog. It's not. You think it's not? Well, you told me it wasn't. Did I? Yes, you did. When did I say that? Before the beginning of the first. I did not. Did you? I did not. Did you? you must have misinterpreted what I said. It's it's the flying spaghetti monster. Okay. I, you Again, asked if it was an Eldrazi don't deck. Don't take advice I from your say opponent. Yes, but it's not really an Eldrazi deck. Well, I said you had the flying spaghetti monster. Like, no, nah, not really. No, that's not what happened. Yes, we can go back to the tape. You did not ask, <laughs> do you have the flying spaghetti monster? And I said, no, not really. <laughs> it's just not really a flying um, spaghetti monster. It is kind of an Eldrazi deck, kind of. Don't ever so, take advice from your uh, from your opponents. You keep saying that. Everybody gets it. Sorry. I think I was still giving you the best advice, though. No, because I could have had that. You could have skull cracked me earlier for three. I would be three down for a card you don't. But you had spell pierce for the skull. Which was getting so. useless pretty quickly. I knew I could fire it off right then because if you paid the two, you wouldn't have had enough to pay two more for spell pierce. I could I should have kept the spell snare back though. I had a spell snare just as a hard counter. Does that technically count as I didn't as, cast it. Okay. Pass turn. So you get a turn and let's see what Bob reveals. Unless okay. Okay. there there are cards that Bob could reveal. Ghoul draws. That is not one of them. I take one, yes. by the way. I almost forgot to do that. I mean it it hardly matters at this point. She's raspberrying me over there. <laughs> You're so cute. Just another permanent for Annihilator 6, I guess. <laughs> well... You might as well just burn my face. Hi, Bob! <laughs> Hi! Now I'll have something for Annihilator 6. Um, I'm going to... No, I'm not. <laughs> no, I'm not, because I'm going to need that. Okay. So now we know how that works. How many... Let's see. I'm counting nine altogether. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Let's see. I'm going to be a jerk face. I'm going to repeal your Ghoul Draws Assassin. <gasps> I'll draw a card, you return it to hand. <coughs> and then you're I'm so going to swing 15 at you. I'm just going to do this now. 
Put you to one. You annihilate six. Which two do you want to keep? Keep a bob so that you can kill yourself off of it. No. Actually, yes. That's what I'm going to do. Don't keep both bobs. <laughs> no, I'm not okay. keeping both bobs. Here we go. My turn. Past turn, yeah. What's he revealed? Oh, a land. Uh, you've got a show. It's a Sorry. lava claw reaches. Which is a land creature thing, my bob? You know, I would have kept differently, knowing how your deck is constructed. Yeah, well, I don't know how my deck is constructed. <laughs> You keep two lands that can tap for black, so that if you draw into Geth's verdict, you can cast it. Well, if I had kept that, then I would have kept, then I would have run into that. Um, not that my draw. If I had any kept better. what, then you would have run into what. If you're, I, you're just saying that the camera is now. Got, if I had kept two lands, yes, then that would have been my draw. You wouldn't have known that though. You could have gone for Geth's verdict to kill my one creature, and then I'd be back to, well, now how do I kill you mode? <laughs> Um, because I it doesn't target. Scoop. Okay. Very well. Monastery Swift Spear was my draw. Um, so now that I know how the hell you win. <laughs> yeah. Let's see that sideboard. Little yeah. Week. I shall go first, by the way. And now, the one you've all been waiting for. The one for which you've all been waiting. I used to be an English major. All right. He's very good at being an English major. He's very good at most things he does. What do you want? No, it's all good. I think the only thing he's bad at being is being bad. Da 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 da. da. Being a bad boy? That's totally how I should have taken that. Okay, so this hand. So this hand. Like what I'm seeing down on this level. And you fit rather nicely here. That's a little excessive, but it's everything I need. Well, almost. I'm not too wild uh, about my hand. Um, I didn't get anything that I sideboarded, and mm. I'm a little worried. But I'm going to keep it anyway, because I'm not sure that I'll get a better hand going down to six. All right. Here you go. Oh, yeah, I go first. I forgot about that. Unless you want to have some tea first. Clash our cups? Clash our cups. As quiet as I can get it. <laughs> what do you say? <clears throat> Ooh, just throwing it to me. Doink. Throwing it down. Throwing it back to you. Just a moment. That didn't take. Are you cracking? Yes, at the end of your turn. <laughs> Again, that's what we forgot to do. You're going down to 19, I presume. Unless you want to bolt me into turn or something. Mm -mm. Just going to 19? Going and getting a blood crypt? Alright. She said yes. Okay. I've got a little bit of strawberry in my mouth. That's a good place to be. <laughs> What's not a good place to be is not doing anything on your first turn as a burn deck. Yeah. Uh oh. Tap. I probably could have, and I probably should have, but, um. Again, this stack. You can go back. No, it's okay. You can go to 17 and try to do something else. It's okay. That would have been helpful. So I am going to monster Swift Spare. Okay. And swing for one. Yeah. Did you have the Swift Spear last turn? Yes. Yeah, you definitely should have. Yeah. I mean, I'm killing you all at once if I'm killing you, so your life kind of doesn't matter. You want to take back? No. 
You sure? I made the mistake. I've got to live with it. This is a casual game. Go. I know, but this is how I learned. This is not exactly professional REL here. Okay. I appreciate the sentiment. Hmm. You learn from your mistakes. Pastor? I kind of want to see if I can save myself. What is that? That land. It's a fairy conclave. It's a classic. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Becomes a 2 1 flying fairy. For the low, low price of one in blue. Black cleave. Yay. As you can see, this deck isn't all in on the combo. It can kill you in other ways. It can kill you in mostly one other way. Pump. Pump in the night. And then the prowess trigger. Mm -hmm. Bump is good. Lava spike? Lava spike is not. I'll spell pierce that. Okay. For two? Three. Three? You still cast it. It okay. didn't resolve, but you still cast it. Okay. Put me to 13. Sorry about that. Yep. Mm -hmm. Um, let me think. Cool draws vampire. Post combat. No. Bolt. Oh, this is before we deal damage. Okay. So we were at 16. That'll put me to 13. And then I'll take four. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah, so that happened. I hear Swift Spe Taylor Swiftspear over there is a pretty good card. Pass turn? Mm hmm. That's what I hear anyway. Well, again, if you're gonna kill me, it's gonna be all at once, so I don't care about life. <laughs> well, that's an awfully morbid <laughs> sentiment. Sorry. <laughs> oh, just messing with you. Let's see. Hmm. Woot woot. Pass turn. Hi, Taylor Swift Spear. I'm gonna get some altars. Just putting Taylor Swift on you. Did you ever see that article about... I did show, show it to you. Uh, Reed Duke's girlfriend, Taylor Swift. How he <laughs> broke up with her. <laughs> it was so bad. Suspend a bolt. Okay, Rift Bolt suspended. Suspend another bolt. Good God. Okay. Swing for one. Yeah. Put me to eight. Your turn. This is going to be fun. Said now, no technically, that's not casting, correct? It's not correct? cast. They'll be cast when they come off suspension. Okay. Making sure. Mm hmm. Hmm. And I will. You better do something. Pass the turn to you. They are technically both cast. Okay, so first things first. I will. Remand one. So it goes back to my hand? Yes. Doesn't matter which one? Doesn't matter which one. Okay. And then. Does it technically get cast, though? Yeah, yes, it's still cast. Prowess still happens. Okay. And then... Cards in hand now? Hmm. Condescend for one. Counter target spell unless you pay one. And then I scry two. Mm, I'll, I'll take that. Okay. 
So it still goes off. Well, first I scry. <laughs> that makes a lot of difference here. I'm going to shove both to the bottom. Okay. It would have been nice earlier, but not now. <laughs> okay, and then I'm taking three. Put me to five. And she is a... Three, four. Three, yeah. My turn? It's still your turn. That was just oh, up sorry. There. Brendan! Brendan! <sighs> Bump. Okay. You didn't even need it then. Put me to two? Swing. That's game. Next turn is Ink Moth, Polymorph, into Emrakul, and I had another Polymorph and two Rune Chanter's Pikes. Uh, you're showing that me something they next, can't see. Sorry, that was my next draw. That's one of the things I thought it in. She has a slaughter games. I would have called That's Imrakul. That's a very, very good <laughs> card. It doesn't mean I win, but, and I actually, it might be better to call, actually, Polymorph or Emrakul, either way, uh, gets the job done. Either way. Um, Probably better to remove, now that I think about it, polymorph. Um, the Polymorph, because if my Emrakul ever does hit the bin for what, one reason or another, it makes my Rune Changer's Pikes less good. And plus I have more Polymorphs. Um, they can actually, at least, if nothing else, they can contribute to uh, Rune Changer's Pike. But that's not bad, not by any means. So you have defeated me. Mwahahaha. Thank you for a good game. Two Blood Moons. Yep. Molten Rain and Slaughter Games are the cards that came in in this matchup. That's a very good uh, sideboard. I would say. The ones that came in here, I mean, after all, I've built it. I ought to. <laughs> it's still not complete, but it's what I have for now anyway. Uh, on this side, what came in were four negates. We're getting to that last one. Woot, woot, Along woot, with woot. two condescends. There's the one. And where's the other? There's the other. Now, I am going to give a little bit, teeny tiny bit of a deck tech for this, because you didn't really get to see the, the deck's alternate way of attacking. See, there are actually uh, ways that you can win through combat. I have Rune Chanter's Pike. In fact, I have four of them. Because you've seen Ink Moth Nexus quite a bit, you did see Fairy Conclave in one of our games. I believe the last, the one where she beat me in game three for match one. And you also saw somewhere around here, where are you? I think you were near the back though. You saw Cloud Form. Now this one's actually my favorite in this match because Blood Moon doesn't stop it, Molten Rain doesn't stop it. Um, and Cloud Form has Hexproof, or rather it gives the manifested card Hexproof and Flying. So if she Blood Moons me, I need Repeal to hit the Blood Moon, I need to counter the Blood Moon, or I need this guy to show up somewhere. And that's really it. Once the Blood Moon sticks, I'm in trouble. I could also go for Jace, Architect of Thought. It's actually just a one of in this deck. Slows them down a little bit, although <laughs> not very much. And potentially gives me another way to go and get Imrakul and cast it. And something from their deck as well. And that's really it. I'll put a, there's a deck list in the description, and this deck is not done, that deck is not done, that deck is definitely not done, but at least I know what I need for this one. This, I decided to go a little bit more towards Singleton Theory in building it. It probably doesn't have enough non-creature creatures. Uh, four Ink Moth, a Fairy Conclave, and a Clown Form. Those are the only creatures other than Imrakul in the deck. And that's maybe not quite enough. I could do with another cloud form for fighting Blood Moon strategies. Uh, Fairy Conclave comes in tapped. I'm not too crazy about that. Uh, given the choice between having any creatures I want, having Flying Hexproof and Flying Infect are probably where I want to be. And just flying maybe isn't enough. Uh, also, you are the craziest art, aren't you? This looks like some rand, like Alice in Wonderland rabbit gone on, like, crack <laughs> or something. So I haven't figured it out. Alright. Did you... This is... So he starts out like this and turns into this guy, maybe? I mean, look at those hands. Oh my goodness. Half-Life 3 confirmed. <laughs> Alright.
Take care, YouTube. Magic community, I'll see you later. Bye-bye.